Hi everyone. Uh, in this video, we will see difference between checked and unchecked exception in Java, and uh, we also see the use of throws keyword. Now, first of all, uh, what is the exception? When we write our program, uh, when we compile our program, so during compilation, compiler will check is there any syntactic error or not? Have we followed all the rules of java programming language or not so if in the case if there is no error uh, the program will be converted into class file and then we can run it but still there are some error which can occur at runtime like uh, if we are taking two input from user uh, and if we are performing division operation on them so it might be possible that user will give zero so we are taking a and b and user is giving value of b at 0 so these thing we don't know at the time of compilation so at the runtime when user gives 0 so a divided by 0 which is infinity in that case our program will be crashed so exception are errors which occurred at runtime so in one line we can say this is a runtime error uh, now uh, in java we are having two type of exception one is checked and one is unchecked so let's see what is the difference between these two so let's say uh, i'm having a um, array of five element a five uh, sorry five and as i i assign some value uh, one two a one two three a two 80 and 87 a 3 a 4 so we assigned some value so these are the five element now <coughs> in java we cannot access a array element out of its limit like uh, this array is having five elements so starting from 0 1 2 3 4 so if we try to access a array uh, if we try to print value of a at fifth index so uh, java won't allow this kind of access uh, so uh, in this case one runtime error will occur and that runtime error will say you are trying to access a out of limit element out of bound now uh, here if we compile this program java c e x dot java e x dot java this is the name of our file and the class name which is having our main method is 1 so the uh, file name is used for compilation and class name is used for uh, execution so java 1 so uh, if you have noticed compilation was successful during compilation there was no warning there was nothing but uh, at the time of execution they are clearly uh, clearly mentioning this fact that array index out of bound exception occurred so any exception uh, about which we don't get any warning at compile time at the execution time if we are getting that error those are known as unchecked exception it means when we uh, compile our program which is having a unchecked exception so java compiler actually won't check for those exception whether you are handling or not so here we are not handling this exception but still we got success to compile our program now if we take example of another program uh, let's take a example of input output program java.iu. star and uh, let's say mm, we want to write a program to take input from user uh, buffered reader new buffered reader new input stream reader system dot in and we are taking a read line so this is an input output program and in every input output program one exception which is known as IU exception that is thrown so this program also cause a uh, generation of IO exception. Now, if we tr uh, try to run this program, so if you can see uh, at compilation time itself, it's uh, saying unreported exception, IO exception. So, 
if your compiler is showing you error uh, regarding exception that your program is having an exception you have to handle it at compilation times so those exception are known as checked exception so for every input output program uh, the exception which is generated name of that exception is io exception so these two line can generate this exception so when we compile our program compiler check okay these two line can generate io exception and this person is not handling this exception so they won't allow compilation so check exception are those exception regarding which compiler will perform a check unchecked exception compiler won't check won't perform any check for unchecked exception so unchecked exception generate error at the runtime uh, and check the exception also generate actually they cause error at runtime but they, they will be checked uh, at compilation time by compiler so how to handle this type of uh, situation like we want to compile our program but uh, your compiler is not letting you compile your program so there are two way one way either you can handle your exception so you have to enclose these two line into try block and then you have to write corresponding cache block in case if you don't want to handle your exception so here comes the use of throws function so what we have to do the block which can generate an checked exception uh, so in after that method signature we will write throws keyword and then write type of exception our code can generate so now when we write throws IU exception, it uh, so meaning of throws IU exception is that the code of main method can generate IU exception, and the programmer is not handling that exception. So now, if we will compile our program, so now there is no error. So compiler will allow your program compilation in case if your program is having checked exception only if you are uh, specifying type of exception which your code can generate using throws keyword or if you are handling that exception by using try catch mechanism so the checked exception uh, which we have to handle or we have to specify in the method signature that our method can generate this exception otherwise our program will not be compiled unchecked ex exception Compiler won't perform any check for unchecked exception. Thank you very much.